G'day guys, welcome to today's vlog. So someone missed the train, didn't they? Hopefully you don't make a habit of this. So I've got to take Shania to school today. And while I'm down there, I'm going to probably do a bit of thrifting just for a few hours or so. It's kind of similar to a couple of days ago when I dropped Shania off. Um, so I'm going to do that again and make the most of it, hit up some thrifts. This is becoming a ritual. Me and I are going into Gloria Jean's cafe to get some coffee. Coffee! It's lit. So tell everybody, Shania, what did you get? I got the creme brulee with almond milk. So good. It's Gloria Jeans reminds me so much of Starbucks. The way they set it up and stuff, like the in-store, it looks like Starbucks. They just probably copied their whole business motto. And I think it's an Australian business as well. But there's so little amount of Starbucks in Australia. The Gloria Jeans is just booming. And the coffee club. Good morning, Springers! So I just popped into Macca's just to plan out the few off shops that I'm going to be hitting up in the next hour or so. Just to get a plan and a list down so that I can go off that list. Making my way to the first one right now. Guys, whenever I go to this off shop, it always seems to be closed, but I think it is open. I can see clothes. So unfortunately, that thrift didn't really have much at all. It was mostly like really old clothing. Like it wasn't well looked after clothing, unfortunately. But on to the next one. All right, guys, quick stop. There's a Salvos and Vinnie's just beside each other. I already went into the Salvos. Just quickly popped on a Gantt shirt and an Abercrombie shirt. Got this one half price, so it was like two dollars something. This one was six. That's a thirty dollar shirt. This one's like a twenty dollar shirt. But I'm gonna hop straight into this Vinnie's here as well. Guys, I just got out of Vinnie's and I got two other items as well. Let me show you. Picked up a book for FBA, but also picked up a polo shirt. It's a pretty cool uh, Austin Martin Racing Hackett brand polo shirt. This brand isn't all that good, I don't think, like in its normal sort of, with like normal clothing and stuff. Austin Martin though has a good following and this is a pretty good selling polo shirt. I've been on the lookout for this one for a while. It was good to come across it today. Uh, I don't know how much these are worth at the moment, but I'm thinking upwards to 50 bucks for this polo. Paid five. Then I also popped on this book as well. Research Methods for Social Work. Really clean book. It's almost in brand new condition for $4. Good price. Selling on FBA for about $51 US dollars. Also, just in case you guys didn't know, I also picked up this cycling jersey here. I didn't get to show you guys, but it is a Campagnolo. I don't know how to pronounce that brand. It's an Italian cycling brand. But the cycling jersey is called MB. Masello Bergamo or something like that. Uh, I paid five for this one. And it should bring and it should bring 35 to 40 bucks. It also it also did come free with two nuts, some almonds, and also a fruit bar package as well free of charge <laughs> anyway i'm going to work on getting the rest of this stuff listed i do have some hiking slash walking shoes here that i want to clean up um the scarpa gore-tex with the vibram sole the very dirty vibram sole these have copped the hiding they're quite filthy they were super cheap and these still bring pretty good value anyway so i'm gonna wash them up and they should sell for about 50 dollars or so So we made a few sales, so let's get them out. I think we sold about four items or so, but let's head over to eBay and check it out. So the first two items are exactly the same, going out to two different customers. We sold the only two Jansport bags that we have in these sort of flower, purple flower colors. One sold for 20, one sold for 27, and they both pay for postage on top of that. If you guys remember a few vlogs back, Picked up about 19 of these bags at about $5 a piece. 
and I had them priced up at like 35 which was quite a lot to expect for these bags so I just decided to bring the prices down and I already sold two. Next sale was a pair of those Saints shorts that I picked up a few days ago. They sold for 35 bucks. And the other item that's sold that's going out is the PlayStation 2 bag that I picked up a couple of days. You guys would have saw it about two vlogs or so ago. This was a pretty awesome find. I paid $4 for this one. It is a bag that holds the PlayStation 2 console and it sold for $35 plus shipping. Rolling down to the post office, managed to fit the parcels in the Jan Sport bag. Let's get these parcels off. I decided to get out and go on a proper roll. I'm probably only going to do like 25 30 k's, just a small loop. But I just got a small taste of cycling through the town there to go to the post office. I want a bit more of it. That's so awesome. Hopefully, you can hear me over the wind. But my dad just passed me going the other way. So he drove that way and he just tooted the horn like buggery, scared the bloody jeevers out of me. Oh, they're out today. Magpies. Oh, shit. One hour later. So, ride done. I rode a bit longer than I was expecting to. It's actually getting pretty dark. When it loads, I ended up doing 41.2 k's. Road out to Coral Inn, so from Bunyip out to Coral Inn, out to Nanagoon, and then back into Bunyip. What was my average kilometers? So 29.1 kilometers an hour average pace. Also, guys, I was riding on the small cog because this thing's come loose again. I need to get a part that connects it right down the bottom here so it doesn't go into the big one. So I was just spinning on the small one, which was still all right. It was just guaranteed me that I had to do a fast cadence. It was sort of like a fast cadence ride, get the legs moving fast. I've just been working away here, listing some items. That is it for today's vlog, guys. Thanks for coming along. If you enjoyed it, give us a thumbs up. I'll see you guys in tomorrow's vlog, so stay tuned for that one. Catch you guys later. Bye.